Footwear primarily has become an extension of your personality, something that's kind of reshaping popular culture. There's this insatiable desire to have change and freshness and newness. We used to have product come to market four times a year, and now product is coming to market every two weeks. I've been in this industry for 24 years, and it's completely changed. Art Center is wonderful at making you reach beyond what you think you're capable of. From the very beginning, sport was a big part of my life. I grew up more of an adrenaline junkie than anything, riding bikes and bike racing and skateboarding. And I race motocross. I think that that's where some of my true design insights really started, was really understanding equipment and the meaning that equipment had in sport, and that if it was done differently or you changed it, that you could influence performance as well. This shoe right here, um, Johan Blake ran his fastest time ever, won a world championship, got a, a silver medal in the Olympics. For him to come back and say that I've never run faster, it's all because of how incredibly fast this shoe is. That's a great example. It's a combination of design and design insights, but it's also a combination of understanding the biomechanics and the human body and how the human body moves and what's important to them. From the very beginning, Adi Dossler was an active athlete and he was also an observer. And through that observation of athletes, he knew that he could make them faster or better through changing their product and making their product better. So we kind of live within the spirit of what Adi started. And the people that we have in our innovation program now are very, very similar. So that everybody has an expertise and they bring something really unique to the table, but we really need them to have uh, a passion for sport and it should be an active part of their daily life as well. Going for a lunchtime bike ride is a savior for me. I solve more problems probably on bike rides than I do anywhere else. I mean it's pretty amazing what uh, that will do for you. You have to have a lot of vision to know where to take things and how to evolve things and how to lead people kind of on these paths that will kind of change their lives through the experience of the product. So assume nothing, because as soon as you assume that you know the answer, you're not asking the right question. And it's through those questions that lead to greater insights that will lead you to bigger, bigger, and more impactful things.